I picked you up. I doubt that. I would never do that. I remember you. There's, uh, there's, we do all of these different poses and photo ops. Um, and basically, how many people, let's start, let's start over again. How many people are, have never been to a supernatural? done this before, but it looks like a lot of people have not. And one of the things that you should know if you're new to this is that in the we have photo ops. Are you aware of this fact? Yeah. I don't know why they call it that. It's just a photo. It's not a photo opportunity. It is just a photo. It's not like, well, I don't know, maybe we'll get a photo, maybe we won't. We're just taking photos, but we call them photo opportunities. Um, I suppose, conceivably, somebody could opt to not take a photo at that point. But no one to date has done that. Um, so we have photo opportunities, and um, and we are, you know, a lot of, a lot of actors from sci-fi shows have been doing this for decades. And typically they will sit in a chair and you will stand on the, the tape mark next to them and ideally not touch them. <laughs> And we have got a, like a slight twist on that, which is um, we will do, you know, whatever BDSM pose, whatever you want. <laughs> there is pretty much, I guess I'm trying to think if there's anything that we have said no to. I think like actual penetration. We <laughs> I think we may have actually done that too. Um, yeah, so it's pretty much whatever, whatever people say. And it's it's like, you know, we've given up all hope uh, of having any kind of self-respect or dignity. Um, you know, someone would come in with like, you know, some moose antlers and, you know, uh, for Jared and, and uh, Tiara for me. And, and they'll be like, hey, Misha, would you mind like riding on Jared? And I, and we're both looking at each other and we're like, sure, you can both do that. Um, we're successful actors, we'll do that. Um, this tangent started from <laughs> Ah, yes, it was you, young lady, who screamed out, sorry about the lipstick. So, one of the things people say is, they're like, oh, could, could I kiss you on the cheek? And usually there's a split second in which I process who they are and what color lipstick they have on. Because if it's like really bright lipstick, chances are they're gonna just like latch on like a succubus onto your face <laughs> and get lipstick all over the place, which is what you did. <laughs> um, and, and, and I think typically those who have no lipstick on whatsoever do a little air kiss and make no contact whatsoever. So it's like the warning sign. But I didn't have time, I saw you you coming and I was like, oh no, no, no. <laughs> and, then we, and then everybody rushed over with like cleaning things and medical gauze and stuff like that. <laughs> anyway, prognosis is everybody thinks I should be fine, so. <laughs> I, I can't really see you and I don't know whether you're crying or how we're doing. <laughs> we're good, we're good, yeah. <laughs>